All right. So then on to number two, what would you say would be the major highlights of your professional growth over the years? Oh boy. That's all tied in right there with that. Uh, major highlights. Uh, gosh, uh, back to the same thing, fundraising. Um, I'll give one really major highlight was when we, I had the opportunity to go in there and redevelop the chocolate from bean to bar, to take those beans and get the milk and do that and be able to go in there and say, yeah, those are the beans I want. Those are the beans we're going to use. We're not taking these. Um, you know, it's, it's like going to, you know, you're going to the coffee growers and going up the mountains and going, hey, that's the beans that I want. So, you know, that was really a really big milestone when we started doing that because then we could sit there and say, hey, yeah, we use bees, beans, we use fresh whole milk, uh, that type of thing. So that was huge. Um, just our expansions, you know, we, do, we just, our growth, our, you know, our go growth kept growing. Our building is in sections. You know, we never went into one big building. It was, you know, 30 feet by 100 at a time and adding on to the right of the store and to the left of the store and expanding everything. You know, in milestone, every day is a milestone. Everything we do every day, you know, you go to, I get up, I'm an early bird, so I get up very early in the morning and I'll spend three or four hours at home because I know by the time I get to work, there's no plan that I've had that's going to work out. This is the <laughs> best plan. This is the best plan I had all day. I knew it was going to come and it was right on time and all that. That doesn't happen during the day. So, hey, you know, it, you know what? It's funny. Uh, you know, I, I basically started this podcast like right after the shutdown happened. And I was like, this is might be the dumbest thing I've ever done because I'm asking all the people who are probably having like the most the least amount of free time if they will give me some time to talk about their business. <laughs> but uh, what I, I was, I'm, I'm curious, um, did you find it, did your family find it very important to remain in Cannonsburg? Like I, I'm positive that you probably kicked it around a little bit whenever you needed to expand, whether or not you would just move to a larger building that already existed somewhere else. Did you find, did you, was that like a, a big time value that you stayed where you were? Well, we had nine, nine major expansions over the years, you know, by adding on the buildings, uh, different where, uh, warehouses, you know, we had some property elsewhere. So warehousing, you know, yes, we've thought and said, Hey, you know what? Are we crazy staying here and keep adding on like this? Why not go do a beautiful building somewhere and do that? And, uh, you know what, we always said, you know what, there, our location in Cannonsburg is just, you know, for this tri-state area, you've got Ohio that isn't that far away. You've got West Virginia that isn't that far away. Literally, you have our tri-state is around Pittsburgh area. We, we cover about 150 miles, we call our service area. I don't know where else we would go. People like it. It's easy on, easy off the exits. Uh, plus, we've been there long enough that it's convenient. You know, you sit there and say, oh, we've been there. I'd love to hear that, by the way, when I see somebody and go. And it, it doesn't matter. I was in uh, South Carolina and uh, walked into a, uh, a boat dock. or we just walking there, and I had my Sarah's Candies hat on somebody says hey where'd you get that hat i said oh i got it at sarah's candy he says, man i've been to that store it's great i love it and everything and i just, <laughs> my, wife, my wife says you gonna tell him who you are i said no <laughs> no let's let him go for a little while i like what he's talking about but this is you know you hear this all over the place that just humbles it humbles me i just don't realize i don't see it from your end I don't. I don't right. see it from the other people. I see it from inside and how hard we work and what we do every day. You know, we're doing another project right now. You know, everybody's into the uh, uh, the cocoa bombs. 
Yep. Did you see the cocoa bombs? That's the, you know, drop it in the cup and put your hot milk in it and do that. Well, you know, we're sitting there and said, can you make cocoa bombs? Now we're sitting there trying to do a, a, a production schedule and get this stuff ready for the first to go in and do that. So we're basically starting from scratch on a project where you have to buy molds. You know, we can't do just, you know, really that's a home project. Yeah. You know, you go to the, you know, go to Michael's or somewhere, you buy the little mold, you buy those little melting wafers and you make your little thing. Um, you know, but to do a production thing on it where you got to make a thousand, two thousand of those a day, uh, we're, we're, we're working on it. So, but that's, that's fun stuff. Yeah. Like yeah. It. Actually, we, uh, my, my company is kind of the same in that aspect. We call ourselves a creative partnership. So you kind of come to us for whatever, whatever wild project you have. And then we are the facilitator. We become, you know, cause we, we're, we're the guys that have the tech, like kind of the hands on, uh, the hands on like uh, industrial tech know how, and then also the design know how and branding know how. So we take all of that and we just find, we find a way to make it happen. We, we facilitate it for the company so that they can just keep working on whatever they're working on. And then we just kind of bring it all together make sure that, you know, the quality meets the expectation. And, you know, that's, that's kind of like what we do. So I understand that completely. Yeah, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what kind of, we're all in the same kind of business. We just, the, the products are different. Yeah. We all do the same thing. Okay, you do. It's amazing. 